We're in uh, Idlewild right now. With all this rain has come all this snow. We just come up to Idlewild. It's like 5,000, 6,000 feet above sea level. So we have some snow. There's a skate park right here. I'm going to try and snowboard in the skate park with the snow. It seems like they've put more stuff in. I don't know how this is gonna go. So let's just see what happens. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of what I thought was gonna happen. <laughs> So we just, we got lunch in Idlewild and then we just pulled up to Humber Park. I was a bit sketched out about driving up here because we tried to come here a long time ago last year and it was, we were slipping and sliding. I had chains on, they didn't do anything. But now today the drive up here wasn't too bad and there is like packed snow everywhere. Check it out. Look how much snow there is at Humber Park. What is this? I built this at home. This is my DIY snowboard feature. I built it at home. Little, I don't know what you would call this, a ledge, box, whatever. Just so you can, you know, ollie on, ollie off, maybe right on, right off. I could make it a kick or two if I wanted to. But yeah, I built this at home and I'm going to try to snowboard on it in Humber Park right here. <laughs> I did a wee earlier too, look. Looks fluorescent. Matches my board. Look, matches my board. Oh. Color, huh? This is a winter wonderland, guys. Oh, are you okay? What happened? Hair no? Got you got stabbed by the branch? There's so much snow here. Wow! Look at it. Sounds like I look like a mom that's with her, with her kid. Yeah, at the hill. At the hill. Come on, little Johnny, we gotta go. Come on, little Johnny, we gotta go. Excited? <laughs> I know. Yeah. I'm puffed. Low hopes there for We're low both hopes. puffed. I don't know if we should go all the way up or just ride here. I made this little ride on feature here so Rachel could, you know, have a crack at it and see about trying a feature because she was scared to do a ride on at Mountain High. So that's what we're going to do right now. She looks like she went out in New York Times Square to see the lights. <laughs> yeah, you did it. You did it. <laughs> Here at an unknown location, and we got the shorty. And we're gonna do some. Uh, we're gonna do some shooting. Hopefully, I got some clay pigeons too. So Rachel's gonna have a crack at throwing them. We got like a little thrower thing. 
Hopefully I can shoot him. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. We're live, guys. I'm gonna go for that bowling pin first, okay? Oh, shit. We'll go for that red thing. Play pigeons, okay? Okay. Nice. The red guy again. Gifted. You're gifted. Oh, I'm out. You only want to use your right hand. You don't want to use both hands. Back like this? Sorry? Do I want it like this or do I want it like this? Yeah, you want it to be parallel with the ground. Do I want it like this? Do it I doesn't matter. You got to snap your wrist at the end, so it doesn't matter which way. Okay, it broke. Let's see a practice okay. run, okay? Yeah, whip it. Keep it parallel. You're using your elbow a lot. You <laughs> use your entire arm like you're, you're, you're cut. Yeah, you're like falling, you're cracking a whip. Through, but there you go. I feel like that's gonna go to the ground. Well, then you need to angle it so it's parallel and you crack up. Okay, this parallel. is the one right here, okay? Parallel and use your whole arm. Don't just use your elbow. That was better. See, it, it flew. It just needed a bit more this power. Is sad. What? This is sad. This is really sad. It's okay. It takes a minute to learn. I feel like this should be easy. You're going to get it. Remember, you're using your shoulder and it's one motion. One big mo Yeah. See? You did it. Should we try one now? Yeah. Okay, one, two, three. Shot it as it hit the ground. Load up another one. This, load high. Okay. Load high, because you're just going like that. Load high. Yeah. That was better. Yeah. Okay, you ready? I'll go slow. Ready? <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck happened? <laughs> Fucking dog. Okay. Ordinary people don't really get to go shooting in australia so like this is a big deal for me like being able to just like get in the car drive out go shoot somewhere so i try to like clean up after i mess i mean there's probably thousands of shotgun shells here but i'm gonna pick up the ones that i know were ours because they're all red so yeah doing my bit for the environment that was fun though i like shooting <laughs> so i actually diy'd made this skateboard screen print press thing right here and I had an image in mind, it wasn't this one. This is an image I use for the hoodies, but I reckon it might look pretty cool on a deck, but I did draw up another image. It did not work out purely because I made the image too wide and screen printing on boards can be difficult because there is a flat section, right? And then where the concave is, it kind of slopes down. So when you go to screen print it, you, you, know, you drag the squeegee along and the sides don't press down. It's only the center of the image, so. I've got to keep my images kind of skinny and narrow. I have another image in mind. Um, it hasn't been made into a screen yet, but I've got a bunch of decks, as you guys can see, to screen print. I'm just um, still figuring out all the logistics and everything, because it is quite tricky. And I went out and bought like the good stuff. You know, for anyone that knows anything about screen printing, this is like the stuff that you use for boards. So yeah, this is where I'm at right now. I've got my screen print press all together. <laughs> And yeah, hopefully I can figure it out soon. Red, I want you to go 
to his house Blow that joint up, don't let nobody out Oh, get Trigger Man, bring him to me Cause I'm tired of this Trigger Man stuff in Tennessee Now all the time while this stuff is going on I called up another roadie on my flip phone Junior, I want you to call down to Texas Special order me a 1994 